Hello, welcome to my channel Pass and Move. This is my Sleeping Giant rebuild with Borussia Mönchengladbach in Germany. Um, what can I say? It's not all been smooth sailing for sure. Um, it's been a bit of a hit and miss first half of the season. Uh, you were with us, I believe, for the 2-0 um, win over Sandelson um, in a DFB Polka second round. We've drawn Borussia Dortmund in the third round, uh, which we're going to be playing today, along with the Schalke game. Um, so yeah, first half season, very difficult. Um, took me a lot to win the players over. Then we had the World Cup break um, and a few friendlies. And since we've come back, it, it's settling down. Um, we've just come out of the transfer window the January transfer window okay so we have managed to get rid of some players okay last time I think we'd only um, got rid of a couple I think Stindl had gone Italiano had gone out on loan and so had Knob um, so since then we've made some sales we've managed to get rid of a few of the um, older members of the crew and a couple of the younger ones that I didn't really want to get rid of but I wanted the money <laughs> I needed the cash so they've had to go um, and some of them were never going to get first team football with us anyway. Um, and then in they've come. I've been buying players in. So I think last time you were with us, I'd only brought Mickey van den Ven. Um, he's playing left back for us at the moment and he, he's, he's playing really well. Um, he is a bit injury prone apparently. He has had a, a little bit of time out. Uh, Rafa Marin, uh, that's one for the future. Um, couldn't resist looking at his stats um he's only a current two star potential four and a half but he's he's not first team material yet this is my um main sign in um magno he's come straight in and made a difference he plays left or right wide midfield he can play anywhere along the anywhere along the midfield in fairness um you know he's very versatile for the system i play uh, and yeah, he's come in, he's made three appearances, two assists, uh, 7.1 and he's three in the cup. He, he's playing well, he's slotted in, he hasn't learnt the language yet, he's on a, a high intensity language course. So yeah, he's um, he's going to be alright. Uh, Cher Nador, that's another one I've signed, he's come straight into the team as well. Um, midfield centre, I do rotate him around a little bit, but yeah, he, he's first team material now. Um, yeah, I only paid 1.2 for him, and he's already up at 9.412. So one of my um, club targets is to buy players and sell for profit. And Magno there, I paid 8 million for him, I think. 18 to 26, so already uh, a good return on that. Then I've got a couple of loan players in. I don't normally play or, or use loan players, but... Um, I've had to because I haven't had the cash. I can't get the really big names to come to me. The, the, I had one I wanted. Um, he, he ended up going to Southampton rather than me, which tells you where I am in the footballing world um, at the moment. So Malik Thor, we've got him in on, on loan. Um, he's cover, but he's playing nearly every game. He's coming on uh, second half. Polino I've just signed and he, he's got injured. Um, I'm not sure if he's back for today or not, but he's... Uh, Teaming up on the other flank with um, Tales Magno. And I got Nicholas Heddle. I've just brought him. Um, backup goalkeeper. Okay, but he's one for the future. Um, fingers crossed he's going to be a good guy. And then I've just brought this guy in on loan. I wanted to buy him, uh, to sign him. But um, believe it or not, he's got like a £3.4 million pound release clause. And I couldn't, I didn't have the funds to do it. So I thought I'd get him in on loan, see what he's like. Um, and go from there. My supporters weren't happy that I've loaned him instead of um, using my own players, but hey ho, you know. Um, so yeah, Paulino, I thought he was injured, he is. So he's gonna sit this one out. Um, and who are we gonna bring in? I'm tempted, Kone's injured, which is a pity. I'm tempted to get, bring a, have a go. I don't normally... Oh, I've got two now. I don't normally have a goalie in. Um, but with the number of subs we've got over here, I've got that l luxury. Um, I'm struggling to get players in that aren't injured. Gruda. I've just, that's the one I've just signed. He needs a rest. But um, 
you can sit this one out on the bench if you like it's being rested for one day so oh, God. it's going to have to be decor then isn't it no laner he can come in right so that's it um starting 11 is pretty much with the exception of wolf um, replacing polino it's pretty much set in stone so we've got summer in goal alvedi frederick benzabani and van der ven um cross about four got neos and the door in the midfield um i'm try I've, I've watched some videos the other day with with this so i'm I'm watching to see whether we can play with a deep lion playmaker and advanced playmaker wide i've got Talez and wolf and then burkhart and plia up front and burkhart's just started it in the net and plia is scoring for fun still so so it's good but we are we're playing better um Today's a tough test. It's Borussia Dortmund at Borussia Dortmund. We will have to play very well to get anything out of this, I can tell you now. So, um, team selection isn't going to change from what I've just discussed. Everybody looks all right with what I'm doing. So, yeah, let's get to the match, see what's happening. Um, this is probably, if we go out of the cup, I'm probably going to complete this season before I come back, um, simply because it's a rebuild and you, you don't want to see all the it's mainly the transfers it's going to make a difference um I'll, I'll see how it's going if we're starting to play out of our socks i mean we're already we're in the european places so we are ticking the boxes but um yeah we'll have to have a look we'll see how we feel if it's going to be a good season and we start challenging for stuff then maybe we can um do another video so yeah ben zabani nods it in but no power on the header and yeah, this is a worry. These guys have already, um, I think they beat me quite convincingly earlier on in the season. And yeah, they do. But we, we've started in the last, since the World Cup, when we've come back after the friendlies and got the season back underway. Um, we're passing quite well. We're linking up. We, we've got a bit of loose passing still in us. Um, giving ball, sloppy balls away. But we we do seem to be um, finding our positions better, finding our players better, um, and picking up second balls, which is what it's all about it, it, in these games. You know, it, you're going to have wayward passes, but you've got to be there then to pick up the pieces. And here you go over the top to play it, and he's through, and it's 1-0. What a cracking start to the game. Four minutes in. This is Borussia Munchen. You know, it, it's um, Dortmund. And, oh, wow, we're, we're Borussia Munchen. Um Absolutely fantastic. Ben Zabaini to Nador, to Naos, to Burkhart, and over the top to player, and one touch bang. Do you know what I mean? That is quality. Pure quality. So we gotta we gotta build on that. We've we've got a you know, another guy and there you go, Wolf straight in on that one. Uh Burkhart again, he's through, he's gonna get it in, plays it across to player again. Oh, it's loose in the middle, bobbling about, and they've managed to get it clear we've got them rattled at the moment guys we've got we've got them rattled and yeah let's just hope we can keep this going um we are showing signs i mean i've had some good things in the press from what the fans so say thinking that there because at the start of the season i honestly thought i was going to get the sack i tell you now when i took this on i hadn't done any sort of um looking into what they were like or no research at all on the team or what they were like now oh, i haven't run any trials or anything i know some people do that but um this is the trial if you like and you're watching it along with me um if we may if i make a mess of it then i've made a mess of it you know but um yeah I've, i'm getting good things from the the press about what the fans think of my tactics and the pressing and the attacking style of football I try to play. And that's sad, isn't it? This is one of the best goalies in the world meant to be. I know he's not at his peak. But what was that? 25, 28 yards. And again, look. Caught on the ball. And I've been bragging him up to you, haven't I, Van der Ven? And what? Oh, well, maybe 25 yards. Bang. Straight in the corner. And it wasn't like he was unsighted. Disappointing goal to leave, lose, but I came into this game not expecting a lot, to be honest. So, you know, we have gone back to the formation we started with. Um, 
or one of the formations we started with. I've had a bit of trouble with formations and players not linking up and I don't know. It's almost like an I find this uh, version it it seems to take a lot longer for players to get into um the system you're playing, you know, and you and you have to do a lot of work with it. But they're passing it around a little bit too easy for my liking and again out to Reyes who's back and we picked that one off and that's good. And this is what we do. We 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 press, press and here's the new boy here. Oh, straight into Burkhardt. And what a goal. And he's going to stick his flag up for that, isn't he? No, he hasn't. So it's on the ref and VAR. And I don't have a lot of luck with this. I've got to be honest. He did look offside to me. Yeah, I thought he was. Oh, I know. I said he was injury prone. That's going to be an injury, isn't it? we get it through to half time and have a look. So yeah, one all half time. We're making a fist of it aren't we um gonna have a quick look at the player that's potentially injured yeah he is knee injury he's gonna have to come off mr scally can come on um i do like that guy as well i have to be honest um this is it come on guys we can do it so yeah um I'm halfway through the season and to be honest the board are very negative with everything I want to do. They're refusing to improve youth. Um they they want us to buy players in instead. They're refusing to improve the training. They're refusing to give us more coaches. They're refusing to give us more skate anything I ask and they're they're like, No, we're happy with what we've got, we're good enough. Um and I'm hoping that's not gonna become a stumbling block because if we're gonna be good we we've got to be chucking out the youth players. We've got to have a good youth setup. We we've we've got to be able to train them and and develop our own players. You know to sell to get the world class players in. Um, at the moment financially we just can't compete with any of the other top teams. And and I'll show you the league in a minute, and you will see the top four are a country mile ahead of the rest of us. You know I'm I'm nine points off fourth place, in, and I think I'm fifth, and I'm like nine points adrift already. You know, um, so yeah, we do need to be looking at something. Uh, but like I said, I find the board so far very negative to everything that I want to do, um, which is a bit of a problem. And I'm not gonna... Yeah, I am. He's only a kid. I'm not going to burn him out. And I do want to get fresh blood on up here. And to be honest, they're on a par, but he's playing slightly better than you. We're going to put this guy in. So that's my five substitutions. Um, I'm not sure. I didn't look to see whether this would go to a replay or extra time. I'm guessing it'll be extra time. But um, like I said, Scally's a a fair replacement. In fact, he was in. And, oh, I thought they'd made. Didn't see player there then. And they're getting it through, aren't they? Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Whew. That was a let off. That wasn't great play. But yeah, one all before the kick off, I'd have probably took this. Especially if it's a replay at our place. It's not gonna be, is it? Or is it? It could well be. Oh, it's extra time. So let's praise them up. You're doing well, keep going, because you are. And now we're gonna pump the fists and this is so I can uh, demand more really. I'm telling them they can improve, so they're not going to be surprised when I ask them for more. So here we go. First half of extra time, and it's all on fitness. Let's just hope we've got the. Because to be honest, since since we oh dear, yeah, heads in your hands, mate. What were you doing? Oh dear, a bit late to pull your shorts up now, mate. Dear oh dear oh dear. Not the start we wanted. In fact, I'd rather have let this in right at the end of extra uh, normal time than be rolled over in extra time. I don't know if I've got any more substitutions because we're... No, I thought it a bit like the FA Cup in the UK, but no. No extra subs. Disappointed. Disappointed there with that. So we're going to start second half. I'm going to demand more straight away. And we're going to, I know it's Dortmund, but we're going attacking. Um, in for a penny or in for a Deutschmark. Although it's, or is it Euros now, isn't it? Um, 
doesn't quite work with euros, does it? In for a cent, in for a euro. It doesn't sound right, does it? But there you go. Um, oh, I'm a bit worried now. I've got to be honest. I don't see us getting a road back into this. And, oh, and there you go. And that's why there's that loose pass. And this is one of my better players. It's one of the better players. And you can't make those mistakes in, in these games. You just can't do it. And I know I had to make the latter stage on that. That is woeful. Woeful. Absolutely woeful. I know one of the conditions is I do well in this cup and make the latter stages. I've made the last eight by the look of it, so I'm hoping that's good enough because we've gone out of this with a little bit of a pop in a fizz, aren't we? And nothing, nothing a lot. No, they didn't do this. I was proud. No, they shouldn't have. So, I do get down in the dumps when we lose. I'm sorry for that, but I can't help it. Um, I want to win everything I play, so 81,000. And we're out in the third round. So it's, oh dear. Twisted knee, three to five days. 605k for a third round tie. There was money to make there, wasn't there? You can have a KG press conference. Club vision failed. What did they think was latter stages then? And I mean, come on, I've, I've gone out to Dortmund. So, so we're going to stick around and do the Schalke game. Um, yeah, disappointed, but hey, it's the league I'm really interested in. I know, very disappointed. That could actually, I don't know what this board are like, but they're all going to... They're all going to lose. Oh, I don't care if he doesn't want to speak to me. I have to discuss a promise with him, don't I? That's the problem. Can we please talk about your promise to me? Yeah, I think that's the way of like, no, I'm in charge here. Oh, can't be doing that. Oh, yeah, well, if people don't want to buy you, mate, I can't give you away. And there isn't, so I'll tell you the truth, there is no interest, so that was a nothing meeting really. And another one that wanted to go, I wanted to loan him out, I tried, again, if you look at his stats, he's, he's got to rent him out. Um, simply no interest, I didn't expect it to work a second time, but it has. And LVD, unhappy promise not kept, he wanted to go as well, he's seriously considering his future, that's fine. Um, you're probably not going to be here long term anyway mate, so... You know, you're here for the rest of this season, and then we'll have a look. So, team selection. We're the favourites. I've got to be honest, yeah, I agree with him there. He's playing really well. Just go through this quickly, please. Yeah, he is going really, really well. Um, a bit worried about this. That could um, be the end of the save, to be honest. A bad result. In the next one, no, if you've got a cold, go home. Home you go. And they, Yeah, they keep buying my youngsters. When I tried to sell them for a bit of money, nobody was interested. And I mean, he's only, what, 4.5 to 55? Now that the transfer uh, window's shut, everybody's offering them contracts. I don't blame them. I, if I, it was me, I'd be doing the same, but... Um, and the only loan offers I had for the players I wanted to keep were, were teams that didn't have any games anyway. They they were, you know, they weren't going to get anything. So disappointed with that. But and now they want to leave because I couldn't get them on loan. So yeah, here you go. Twenty-seven thirty-six. Nine points between us and Wolfsburg. Um, I have been sort of loitering around this sort of area before the World Cup, so I am sort of cementing myself in fifth place i think we finished 10th last season under the old manager so yeah it's a few changes i've got a few of my own players in now compared to rather than just what i inherited so i am hoping that we're gonna kick on i mean these are 12th i should really be beating these i need to be beating earth of berlin um yeah plenty to go at for sure We're all good with the fitness. Sorry, I missed that. Then I just uh, uh, we're going straight into the tactical meeting. 
and Frederick was injured, so he's out. And this is your big moment, mate. You're going to play the entire game. Polino's into a oh, look at this. Gouda can come in. Rocco reads fitness. He's injured. He's got to come out. Scully can go in there and then he can come out. And it's going to have to be decor, isn't it? Because everybody else is either injured or not at the club. So there was a change I wanted to make. No, there wasn't. He's not there. Of course he's injured. Uh, <clears throat> so yeah, it's going to be pretty much the same um, as we were. Ball playing defender, that's what you've got. No, it isn't. So no, it will be. Oh, that makes a lot of difference. Um, don't know to drop this guy in the midfield. He's suffering. Oh, Thurum's injured. There's no point doing it. So we'll be putting Grude in and see what he does. And he's not going to stay as is. Okay, so that's the team we're going to start with today. There's a summer in goal. I'm really tempted. Because he needs to get a few games under his belt to develop. In for a penny. Could be a mistake, but hey ho. Um, goalkeeper defender as opposed to sweeper keeper. We do that. That's that. Right, let's give it a go. Sorry, I was doing a team, wasn't I? So yes, Hedl in goal. Alvedi, Theo, Benzabani and Scali across the back. Nios and Nador in midfield. Tales and Gruda. Um, just got him on loan. He's only a youngster, only a kid. Um, stats are looking good. Wait and see, isn't it? Um, Burkhart and Plea. So, yeah, fingers crossed we're going to make a difference and uh, get some points under our belt. Because it's all about points at the moment. I'll never press. And I want to see a marked improvement from all of you today. I really do. I want to win the game. Fed up a blooming mistakes all the time. And here we go. Kick off and skip. So, yeah. I'm quite enjoying this save. Um, it's a lot harder than I expected it to be. Uh, I've got to be honest. And, oh, good God. And it's just got that little bit harder. It's all right. I'm mentally kicking myself in the butt for swapping the goalies. But I don't think you can blame the goalie for that. I really don't. But yeah, it's been a lot tougher. Um, I expected them to have a little bit more cash than they did. I expected the board to um, be interested in developing a club um, to build our profile up. And oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh, have I made a big booby? Is it too early for this keeper? Oh dear. He's meant to be a shot stopper as well, with good reflexes. And we're at home. Right, let's see. We haven't settled. We've got time to settle. This isn't over yet. Um, you know, if we get into our rhythm, can't just blame the goalie because there's 10 players in front of him. And, uh, oh, look at that. There was no effort to get the ball there. Oh, well, one there, by the way. So we are in trouble. Um, there's no two ways about it. And that's nicely cut out, Gruden. Nice little ball to play. A player's now getting forward. Can he find somebody in the door? The door played out wide. And that blue cart's coming through. And there you go. We're back in. So, yeah. I'm stressing about the goalie. But if they haven't got the ball near the goalie, he ain't going to let him in, is he? You know, so it's not just his fault. And uh, once we get going, and I do like that in the door. I really do. Um... I'm really impressed with him and the youngster I've got, Tales. He's um, a couple of assists to his name already. 
So yeah, maybe it was just a bad start. We had to find our foot after the cup cup exit, the way we lost that. Um, yeah, we're, we are a better team than what we've shown so far. Um, and we have been cutting out passes and counter-attacking beautifully. This worries me because any shot from here could end up in the back of the net. But the keeper's got down and out that. That's going to settle him down a little bit, so that's good. Keeper's actually got a 7.1. He's not playing that bad. You know, so we've just had a dodgy start is all. But we do need to stamp on it in the midfield a bit. We're not... Um, but you can see they're starting to press and close down. Uh, passing men on and whatnot now. So it is getting a little bit better. And oh dear. Oh, that's a good head down. And yeah, you can see little patterns of play. It's coming together. I'm just worried about this board not giving me the time to do it. Um... And then where do I go? You know, it's not like a save where I'm just going to go to another team or um, or carry on the save. But at the same time, I, I don't want to leave the save. Um, please, 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 please. Why don't I keep it covered? Uh, yeah, I don't want to lose the save. I'm really enjoying my time in Germany. The stadiums are phenomenal. Um, but if I'm sacked, then that is... But it, it's a rebuild of Borussia Mönchengladbach, so there's there's nothing else I can do. You know, if I'm sacked, it's a failed rebuild of Borussia Mönchengladbach, isn't it? And maybe they do want to just... Oh, dear. Just believe in their 70s and dream of what it used to be like. I am going to change a goalie, I think, at halftime, guys. I can't let the youngster put up, go through this. Like I said, he was a 7.1, so he's doing well. But again, he's got caught out there. But our back four in there, is it? It's, it's like a different team to what I've been watching, to be honest. And it can't just be the goalkeeper changing. It does that. And that's dropped us back out of the, play, out of the European places as well. And I'm a bit concerned about my job. Um, not angry. I am. I'm just disappointed. Um, tactics. I'm sorry, mate. Maybe that's my fault, not yours. In danger of losing discipline, so maybe that's a good move. Um, I'm going to blow a bit of smoke at their butts now. Keep going, you know you have the ability. They do. Right, second half. We are going attacking, okay, because that's what I do. And we are going to go and demand more right from the off. So I'm expecting a bit of pressure to start with. But we should... Uh, it's not too late to turn this around yet. Unless we let another silly goal in at this stage. And they are running through and around us like... For fun. I don't know whether it's tiredness or... Or what? Morale. It's got to be morale, hasn't it? It's a carryover from a cup game. Um... Same as when you play in Europe. If you have a, a bad result in Europe, it can take you two or three games to get over it. Uh, and then uh, each game it gets worse and worse and worse, and it's harder to get out of the rut. So we do... I was looking at, you know, I thought 12th place again after Dortmund. This would be all right. That's a penalty, but we'd take the goal instead. Burkhardt again whistles up. He's going to disallow it, isn't he? Even though it was should have been a penalty. Oh, this is all the time. And they're walking away, so they've given up... Disallowed... So are we going to get the penalty then, ref? Why isn't the ref, why isn't VAR taking it back to the penalty? Good God! <clears throat> Excuse me. That is our way back in, and or was our way back in. But here we go again. Come on, it's not too late, lads. Straight to Magu, back in. Brookhart again. Oh, just wide of that post. And I've got to make some subs here, guys, because uh, we've got a few that are dead on their feet. Stefan Lane are there. I don't think I've got anyone for you, Mr. Scally Nets. This guy needs to come off. That's going to be Vigo. You're going to come off, and that's going to be Itakaru. One, two, three, four, five. That is it. That's our changes. The rest of you are going to have to fall to pieces on the pitch. Would have liked to get you off, mate, but we do still want to win the game, so let's demand a bit more. Oh, another... Mm. Thank you. And the youngster actually tied it up off of one of the more senior players of the team. And players through and... Oh, he's just got his hand on it. Come on, guys. We need a goal here. 
I don't care about Dushbank Park. I want it here. And here we go. Over to the back post cleared. Mag, you know, make a effort for it, mate. Don't just let it go out. And we're back to six, believe it or not, even though we're losing. Um, this is really poor. We're not going to pull this back. It's just no. Nobody's playing well. Oh, we're caught on the ball again in our own box. But we did get our foot in there. A player brought it back so that they could get us again. And oh, the pass. It's like watching school ground stuff. Oh, I could go watch my local football for this level. Really could. And yeah, this is just going to fizzle out. It's disappointing. Nice over. Oh, and that's what I was going to say. That's a nice one. But oh, and I'm going to look at that again. Come on, ref. Thank you. About time one went our way. I was beginning to think that the old game had it against me for a minute then. But um, yeah, good. Good header at the back post by the guy on loan. It's a little too late for make a difference, really. We've lost three two at home against a team that's in the bottom of the table standings. I'm really worried about losing my job, guys, because I'm now out of uh, European places. And I was hoping to get a little bit of breathing space between the teams below us. Okay, so, I've survived. Um, that's got to be it for this episode. Um, well, I say I survived. <laughs> I don't know. It's not looking good. Um, yeah, I'm going to go off and play some games now off, off camera, see what happens. Um, if I'm sacked, um, I'll obviously come straight back. Um, just to wrap up the series, really, which is a bit disappointing. <laughs> halfway through the first season. But yeah, um I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, leave a like if you have. And you can tell I'm a little bit down uh, in my voice, I expect. But yeah, leave a like, um, subscribe and hit that notification button. Thank you very much for watching.